we received this item from IC Station China. As you can see here inside. Uh, this beautiful module and here are uh, four connectors or whatever uh, connecting pieces they have sent uh, which will be fixed here if we are going to fix this module in some casing or something like that so okay this we will put side and then here the real module you can see and this real module is very very much beautiful from IC station and this is what is adjustable step up step down power supply module boost buck converter lcd display voltage regulator so the regular price is nine dollar and 39 cents whereas they have given it an offer and nowadays it is six dollar and 57 cents so this beautiful module you can see uh, this is working on some 5.5 volt to 30 volt input here is we will apply the input and here we will get the output so the output will be 0.5 volt to 30 volt and this is step up and step down both in one time so this is really a beautiful nice module you can see and this heat sink uh, you can see this is double taped and we can put it here for bigger power you will put the heat sink and for the smaller power it is not required even so that's why they have given it like this so if it is required to you you will put it or otherwise you will not uh, the thing is this is some 3 to 4 ampere uh, 3 ampere is very very much stable and 4 ampere you can even use and some 550 watt 30 to 50 watt this module can bear so for most application this uh, small module is useful this module you can use as uh, an adjustable voltage power supply adjustable voltage power supply with current control here is the current control and here is the voltage control these two potentiometers they will and here is the display here are uh, two switches one is in and out the second one is on off so this will be switching on and off the output and this one will be uh, selecting between input and output on the display so now we are going to power it up for the powering up i will use this 12 volt source and i will connect one uh, light which is of course some 10 watt 12 volt we can check it over here so this source is also 12 volt you can see this light is glowing with this 12 volt and it is showing 12 volt to us now what we will do is we will connect uh, this power supply so the positive and negative we will take care of so this one is, is my positive so the upper one upper hole is for positive this connector and the lower hole, hole is for negative so i will connect it same way as the positive and negative are but take care because if you will reverse the polarity it can damage now you can see here is the display had been come and this is showing some output something output and we can select between input and output input you can see 12 volt which we had applied and the output is zero because the output is off now we can switch on output from here so while we will switch it on you can see the out led had been come on now what we can do is we will have to connect the load so then we will make some experiment with so for the load there is no discrimination for this lamp the negative and positive but negative and positive are there of course the upper one is positive and the lower one is of course the negative so this way we will connect it and then later on i'm showing you in a while we will make some experiment with so this one is we connect it and short circuit we will take care not to short circuit anything so now you can see this light is in front of you i will bring it in cam in front of camera so this is glowing now with 8.56 volt so without for the voltage we will adjust this potentiometer and we can increase the voltage like this so you can see the intensity of the lamp is also increasing with an increase of voltage so some 12 volt we will do and if we will go beyond even it will increase so the input is 12 volt we can select between the input and output and input is now 11.45 because our supply is not that much regulated so 11.45 volt is the input and the current is 0.7 so the output we can see output is 13.5 and the current is of course 0.7 so we will not increase from this value but even we can go up to 33 volt i will show you later on while i will disconnect this lamp 
so the other thing is this current control we are now going to adjust this current control and we will see so how this current control is working or functioning so this is what we are going to increase it I think yeah it is increasing clockwise and if we will decrease it so we will you will see the current limit and the intensity of the light will also decrease in some point so now it is de decreasing but it's a potentiometer with multi turns so some point you will get it yeah now you can see it's reducing the voltage and also reducing the current both at the same time and also here the red indication had been come so this is showing the current limit and the light glow you can see just barely you can see it's glowing and we can even in decrease it to zero or some value like this one you can see now it's up to almost zero so okay now this red had been come and you can see the limit had been come and this lamp glow is not there so we can increase this current by increasing the value of this potentiometer some multi turn again i will say some somebody commented on my channel that why you are uh, turning it too much so the answer is this is multi turn so now you can see the current limit has been passed and now light you can see it's blowing perfect so this one is and this is really a beautiful module the ic station all products are good they are working they are perfectly working they are cheap they are very reliable and they they this company is also very much reliable they are sending you what they are charging you so thank you for watching if you like this video give a big thumbs up subscribe my channel and press on the bell icon so then you will get my notifications on each upload thanks